and we have some breaking news coming in at this time. Randhir Singh is to withdraw his candidature from the IOA elections. That means that there will be no challenger to Abhay Singh Chautala for the post of Indian Olympic Association's president. That is the latest coming in that uh, it seems that there will be no challenger to Chautala in the Indian Olympic Association for uh, the issue of presidentship with Randhir Singh now withdrawing his candidature from the IOA elections. It seems that it is uh, the path has been cleared for Abhay Singh Chautala who might end up becoming uh, the president of the Indian Olympics Association just by default considering that Randhir Singh has pulled out of the race. Well, in case uh, you are just tuning in, the latest breaking news coming in at this time is that Randhir Singh is to withdraw his candidature from the Indian Olympic Association elections. Remember, there will be no challenger now to Abhay Singh Chautala for the post of IOA president. That means, uh, in all probability, Abhay Singh Chautala might end up becoming the president of the Indian Olympic Association. These elections have been also uh, mired in controversy, but the latest... Let me in fact go across uh, to Shumon who joins us uh, for more on the story. Shumon, why has Randhir Singh pulled out and what does it mean for Abhay Singh Chautala? Well, Randhir Singh, uh, uh, it, it seems that he is quite unhappy and uh, uh, he has actually said that he will withdraw because a uh, lot of manipulation is happening, a lot of uh, uh, things that uh, he did not want. Uh, it to happen is happening in IOA and uh, above all the most important thing is he doesn't have the numbers uh, to win the IOA election so that's uh, a primary reason as well so uh, he at 3 o'clock there will be a press conference where he is going to allege a lot of other things and what can be expected is, is for the first time he probably will uh, take names and that uh, might range from Suresh Kalmadi to Avish Singh Chakala, who is all set to win the IOA election unopposed. Right. All right, uh, uh, Shumon. But uh, what does it really mean for Abhay Singh Chautala? Does it mean that since there is no challenger remaining, he will end up becoming the president of the IOA? Uh, that's most likely because nobody is there. And uh, the last date for withdrawal of nomination is uh, uh, what three days back. So even after that, when you think is withdrawing, so that technically that can be done even on uh, even one day prior to the election. Uh, as of now, there is no other post, uh, uh, or no other person who is contesting. I do not think Randi Singh has a, a, even a chance to uh, replace uh, his candidate with his other name. So, uh, Abhay Singh Chautala, who already has 27 of the 37 National Sports Federation votes, uh, he was already uh, winning the election. Uh, he had all the votes. Though uh, he a lot of uh, manipulation and purchase of votes as well. Uh, and uh, he also says that uh, the Chautala group, which uh, Chautala has been uh, all the members, the National right. Court Federation people uh, who were supporting Suresh Kalmadi is now supporting Chautala. So right. uh, Randhir Singh alleges that one Kalmadi is replaced by another uh, Kalmadi. So in all likelihood, everything Chautala is going to win the IOA okay. election for the post of President unopposed. All right, Shivan. Thank you very much for joining us with that breaking news update.